think I also read that it is open for fishing year round. So, if that's the case, maybe we'll drop a line in the water. Okay, so let's go on our way to Rife Lake. Sure is pretty. The mountains in the background, the snow, it's gorgeous. Well, here's Rife Lake. We'll do a little panorama here. From, from my uh, truck and camper, we'll just do 360. I believe Rife Lake is a man-made lake and I believe that the dam is Mossy Rock Dam. And the uh, river that dams up I believe is the uh, Chehalis River. But what a beautiful lake it is. Kinda desolate this time of year. People, uh, not too many people come up here and enjoy the great outdoors as you can tell by the mountains with snow in them that it's pretty cold out here. Uh, right next to the lake shore, I'm actually about uh, 15 feet from the water. I don't want to get too close to the water right in this location because it's sandy and the closer you get to the water, the muddier and muckier it is. But what I wanted to show you here is I'm almost at water level and now I turn and look up and there's the RV and it's probably 50 feet higher than the water which shows how low this reservoir is. So uh, I don't know why it's that low. We've had lots of rain this year. I guess maybe they've lowered it in anticipation of springtime and all the snow melt. So they've got room to capture the snow melt. That'd be my guess. So uh, there's the RV, pretty impressive. One of the things that I found quite interesting is you can see this trail of driftwood goes off into the distance there. Well then you come down here about 20 feet and you see another trail of driftwood. goes off into the distance and then you come down here another 40 feet a little harder to walk so I'm not gonna go all the way down but you see another trail of driftwood that goes off into the distance and I surmise that each of those levels of driftwood indicate how high the lake was filled 
probably during successive years. So here we have a record of the height of the water for at least three years. <laughs> 